right. In problem number two of section 3.2, we're asked to find the area between the graph of cosine of x and uh, the x-axis from x equals 0 to 2 pi. So if you want to picture this visually, uh, graph of cosine of x. Looks approximately like this. And 2 pi, of course, is not going to be to scale with my drawing, but uh, we have 0 and then uh, pi over 2 and 3 pi over 2. All right, so we want the total um, shaded area. And the, uh, by the theorem earlier in the section, we know that this uh, area is going to be equal to the integral from 0 to 2 pi of the absolute value of cosine of x dx. So now we need to split this up into the, the point parts where cosine is negative and, or it's positive. We know that it's positive between 0 and pi over 2. Uh, so this be equal to the integral from 0 to pi over 2 of, well, cosine is positive, so the absolute value is just the same as cosine of x. Now from pi over 2 to 3 pi over 2, um, cosine is negative. So we'll add the integral from pi over 2 to 3 pi over 2 of negative cosine of x dx. And finally, uh, cosine is positive from 3 pi over 2 to 2 pi. So from 3 pi over 2 to 2 pi, uh, absolute value of cosine is just cosine. All right, and I'm running out of room here, so I'm just going to continue this uh, up at the top. Now the uh, integral, or the uh, indefinite integral of cosine is just um, sine. This would be sine evaluated from pi over 2 to 0. So sine of pi over 2 minus sine of 0. And we'll add integral of minus cosine of x, but it'd probably be easiest just to pull that minus sign out. And we'll have minus sine of 3 pi over 2. Uh, minus sine of pi over 2. And finally, uh, we'll add sine of 2 pi minus sine of 3 pi over 2. All right, so this simplifies to um, sine of pi over 2 is 1 minus sine of 0 is 0. And the second part, we'll have sine of 3 pi over 2, which is minus 1, minus sine of pi over 2, so minus 1, plus sine of 2 pi, now 0, minus sine of 3 pi over 2, sine of 3 pi over 2 is minus 1. So this is 1 minus a minus 2, so 1 plus 2. And here we have negative, negative 1, so plus 1, and this whole thing is 4. So see that this whole area um, between uh, the graph of cosine of x and the x-axis is actually equal to 4.